Mario and friends headed to the space bypass in search of the pure heart. How did Scrubs know about the secret route? Our heroes start, stared suspiciously at him. Why are you staring like that? said Scrubs. Are you falling for Scrubs? In the darkness of space, the eyes of Scrubs glinted mischievously. Hello all you crazy people out there, my name is Dragonite, welcome to Super Paper Mario Chapter 4-3, The Gates of Space. Alright, what's up next? This is the Space Bypass. Yeah, from somewhere in here we can enter the Woe Zone. Come on, Space Grunt, look for the entrance, Squeeork. The Woe Zone? You simply must be kidding me. I demand answers. It's a prohibited zone, Squirp. Some call it the Space Graveyard, Squinks. It's a complicated maze. They say once you go in, you can never get out. And supposedly the pure heart is hidden at the very back of the maze, Squinky. How would you know that? Who are you really, you incontinent little imp? Squirple, squirple, squirp! I made some room with that pit stop, now I'm hungry. But don't worry about that, Space Grunt. Find the woe zone entrance, squibble. Alright. <clears throat> this is the outer limits, and we have returned to playing Bullet Hell in space. And here I see we've got ourselves a, uh... A fancy shooting star and let's see because I like I like outer space about as much as I liked it in, in chapter 4 1 I think I will be uh, avoiding going into 3d if I can if I can get away with it and I also am, I'm sure that ow well thanks I guess I'm sure that I'm going to have some have some issues going through doors in this chapter the way that I uh, I'm pretty sure I had issues with going through doors in Chapter 4-1. Uh, when I, uh, when I first decided to do this Let's Play, I was planning on getting through the entire recording in, like, three weeks. This isn't X marks the spot. I have a feeling I know what to do with this. But, uh, it's been, like, six weeks since I played this game last because I've been busy with other things. Anyway. Fancy. So, we've got a weirdly convenient Scorps-shaped hole. Please never make me say that again. In this, in this, uh, in this pillar over here. Squirble squawk! This hole. What a lovely shape, Squirp. I don't know why, but I want to be squeezed into there! Someone squished me in it. Want to squish Squirps into there? I like how they, they went out of their way to make the word squish shake on the screen. So, because apparently, apparently the depth to which I will sink for narration in video games is basically negative infinity. Uh, between this and certain visual novels that I've done in the past. We will indeed squish Squirps into that Squirps-shaped hole and create a uh, <clears throat> rather impressive-looking space gate, I must say. These lead from the space bypass to the Woe Zone. Through this gate is the way forward, Space Grunts, so this is basically the uh, interstellar version of, uh, say, a uh, toll booth, perhaps. And an exit ramp. So we can... Uh, we can make our way over this way, and we have another X marks the spot, which I expect will be a, a similar deal. Alright, they uh, make sure to make an impressive entrance, don't they? So we are going to talk to the Squirp shaped hole. Squirple, Lurple, Squee! Another wonderful shape. I feel another compulsion must get twisted into there. Someone twist me in. Want to twist Squirps into there? <sighs> what the what what the game authors were thinking and what the Nintendo of America translator people were thinking when they did this game, I have no idea. Would love to be a fly on the wall at that meeting. Something something's missing, Squirk. Definitely. I can't shake it. It's only one solution. That's right, Squirps must eat something yummy. Squirps will not move until Squirps eat something good. This I declare Squirp. All right, so we've got our mission for this uh, for this level. It's a sign say, "Oh, chosen one, what will fulfill the strange alien's desire? Something that ends with something that starts with Cho, and ends with late. This will open the way." Interesting. So is there anything beyond this uh, this teleporter wormhole black hole thing? I never really thought of these as black holes. Maybe it's because they don't look the part. But, um, I, at the same time, I kind of feel like that's, oh, yeah, I, uh, don't have Scorps with me, so I cannot shoot forward. At the same time, I kind of feel like that's what they were going for, design-wise. Anyway, uh, we have here another teleporter. Alright, I don't remember my way around Chapter 4 or 3, so I, I guess it's, uh, 
just as well if I wander around for a little bit. Um, let's see. Do I, like, do I want to... Ow. Mario, stop conking your head on these things. Do I want to, uh... Ah, this is this is going poorly. Do I want to like make an effort to catch all the catch them all, catch them, put everything on a catch card if I can? Um, I don't know if I do, but at the same time, like I have a catch card in my inventory, and I uh, kind of feel like, given given the opportunity, I would like to use it just so that it gets out of my inventory because your inventory in this game is really really tiny, so. Alright, I'll, uh, I'll deal with that when I have to. What's up this way? Alright, we have more... More of these rotating bars of doom. Uh, what are, what is your name? Tippy? No? Alright, don't know why I couldn't get the Tippy on it the first time. That's a Hadron. I don't know if that's a, if that's a pun on Hadron, the, uh, uh, part of the, the standard model of particle physics, but... We'll, we'll go with it. It's an odd object in the space bypass. They say it's indestructible. Alright, that makes it sound like I have not seen you before. And if I were to go into my my cards list and just refresh my, my memory of what I've got. Alright, I've got jellions, photons, and nothing else. So I guess uh, to get it out of my inventory, I will indeed catch one of these hadrons. Come on. You know you want to. Thank you very much. That is an... All right. Well, I didn't have one of those either, but I guess I I guess I must have uh, selected the wrong thing with the Reaver Mount. So, because this is not exactly my favorite level in the game, I will not be going out of my way to explore every corner of it. Um, let's see, when I see all right, <clears throat> actually got here fairly quickly. When I see a lot of blocks like this, I instantly become suspicious that if I flip into 3D, there's going to be something of use. But it seems that that is not the case here. What is this? Why is there just a block? Who knows? Anyway, if I flip into 3D here, you can see that we've got basically... Oh, it's a, uh, a coin. It's a coin block. You can see that we've basically got, like, the, uh... Interstellar version of, like, a 7-Eleven. Something like that. And if I were to enter, very slowly, I have a twinkly day! Welcome to Twinkle Mart! If we're not closed, we're open. That's how it works. Wow, I was so lonely since I grand opening your first customer. I think I should have thought about the location more when I bought this place. What they're looking for today? Just grab whatever twinkles your eye. Uh, just, just grab whatever grabs your eye. Twinkle shoppers. Alright, so we can buy a sweet choco bar, a shroom choco bar, or a golden choco bar. Uh, these are, uh, these are essentially, uh, just fancy healing items. Nuts and nougat, uh, shroom flavor bar, and luxurious chocolate. Uh, it does not matter which one you get, I'm just gonna go and... Since I, I foresee that sooner or later, I'm going to want a money sink. I'm just going to buy the fancy one to give it to Squirps and I uh, hope he appreciates it or whatever. But um, you can get the cheap one if you want. He will have slightly different dialogue when you give the different chocolate bars to him. Uh, we can get out of here. All right, let's see if I can uh, if I can find my way back to the. Let's see if I can if I can find my way back to the uh, the gates of space. Ow. I have to say, they hurt you, which is annoying, but they do make a very satisfying gonging noise when you hit them. Alright, I think I came through this one. Alright, that's a save block, and I think I approached this from the... Uh, from the left. So I'm gonna want to go this way. If I want to get back. Ow. Ow. Very glad that there's a period, there's like a grace period after you take damage that you can't do it again. So I would have taken like three damage right there. Which would have been a little bit annoying. Alright. Um, from here... I feel like the, I feel like the, the portal was like up or down or something like that. My, my memory is not, not amazing when it comes to this sort of thing. Okay, this one is purple. I think it was a purple one. The blue ones are like the, uh... Alright, yeah, I see the sign, the save block, and Mario's even going to come out of that facing the right way. How convenient. 
Let's see, Squirps! Got some food. Squirps, so hungry, Squirps can't move. Well, Squirps can move, but so very slowly. Squirps need to eat something yummy. All right, we have got calories for you, mister. Squirps is a gourmet. You think I'd be satisfied by something like this, Squag? But you want all this travel space, Grunt, so I don't want to, but... Squat Shump! This is... It smells delightful squigs. It tastes delightful squirt. It's perfectly perfect. Oh, Squirps can't see through tears of joy. Squirrel, Squirgle. Too good! As one does. Sorry about that. Scrubs can carry it away. This gate. It's appeared. The goal is nice, Swoggle. Let's go, Space Grunts. Alright, so, that was actually a fairly short chapter. I want to say that was only like 11 or 12 minutes. Um, let's see. You go- ah! I hate gates in space. I don't remember if I dedicated like a an exorbitant amount of time to complaining about them in um in chapter four one, but boy, do these drive me insane. Anyway, we are done with outer space, unless we want to be revisit this chapter for space chocolate or whatever. End of chapter. All right. Do you want to save your progress? I do not. I'm gonna end this off here. My name is Dragonite. This has been Super Paper Mario. Next time, we're hitting up the Woe Zone. I will see you all later.